on the middle way. 400, Verses, Root, Text. Chapter 9. 201, All are produced for their effect. Thus none are permanent. There are no. Tithagatas other than. Subduers, who cognize, things as they are. 202, There is not anywhere anything. That ever exists without depending. Thus never is there anywhere. Anything that is permanent. 203, There is no functional thing without a cause. Nor anything permanent which has a cause. Thus the one who knows suchness said what has. Come about causelessly does not exist. 204, If the unproduced is permanent. Because impermanent, things, are seen to be products. Seeing that the produced exists. Would make the permanent non-existent. 205, That space and so forth are permanent. Is a conception of common beings. For the wise they are not objects perceived. Even by conventional, valid cognition. 206, A single direction is not present. Wherever there is that which has directions. That with directions therefore clearly. Also has other directional parts. 207, Since it exists, functional things. Are seen to start and stop. It is governed by other factors. Thus it is also an effect. 208, Any cause without an effect. Has no existence as a cause. Therefore it follows that. Causes must be effects. 209, When a cause undergoes change. It becomes the cause of something else. Anything that undergoes change. Should not be called permanent. 210, A thing with a permanent cause is produced. By that which has not come into being. Whatever happens by itself. Cannot have a cause. 211, How can that which is produced. By a permanent thing be impermanent? Never are the two, cause and effect. Seen to have incompatible characteristics. 212, That of which some sides are causes. While other sides are not is thereby. Multifarious. How can that? Which is multifarious be permanent? 213, The cause which is spherical. Is not present in the effect. Thus complete interpenetration. Of particles is not feasible. 214. One particle's position is not asserted as also that of another. Thus it is not asserted that cause and effect are the same size. 215. Whatever has an eastern side also has an eastern part. Those whose particles have sides admit that they are not partless particles. 216. The front takes up, the back relinquishes, dash. Whatever does not have. Both of these, motions. Is not something which moves. 217, that, which does not have a front. Nor any middle. And which does not have a rear. Being invisible, who will see it? 218, the effect destroys the cause. Therefore, the cause is not permanent. Alternatively, where the cause exists, the effect does not. 219, a permanent thing that is obstructive, is not seen anywhere. Therefore Buddhas never say that particles are permanent. 220, if liberation which is other than what binds, is bound, and the means existed. It should not be called liberation, since nothing is produced from it. 221, in nirvana there are no aggregates and there cannot be a person. What nirvana is there for one? Who is not seen in nirvana? 222. When free from attachment at liberation. What good is the existence of consciousness? Also to exist without consciousness. Is clearly the same as not existing. 223. If at liberation a self existed. There could be a seed of consciousness. Without it there is no speculation. With regard to worldly existence. 224. It is certain that those liberated from suffering have no other self. Therefore, the end of the self 
should always be affirmed as good. 225. The conventional is preferable. But the ultimate never is. Ordinary people have some belief in this. But none in the ultimate. 